Katimbu za munyonyo gere Na makuro ni na mugaba Mukuba kauna Musta identa mivu machomba Morning run done It's like a glow by me I don't feel sick anymore At least not that sick As my friends told me this morning I'm still sounding pretty nasally But feeling better you're welcome. It's Friday right now. My last vlog was Monday. We got a lot to catch up on. I need to get cleaned up first, though. Good morning. <laughs> Is back? Oh, it's sharpened. And me, I want to sit up. <laughs> yeah, you want a selfie? Hey. Yeah. Yeah, okay. we'll do a selfie with, with both of us. Okay. <laughs> okay. Getting a little bit of a later start this morning. Because of my sickness, I've fallen behind on a number of things. I'm working on a newsletter that I've been trying to get out, probably get out this weekend. If you want to get part of it, actually go to ventureleather.com, sign up for it there. It's going to be a hot one today. It's about 10 o'clock right now. Kareth knows what he's working on. Actually might be a little bit of a problem we're making too much, especially with the product Roy's bringing back. Doing a lot of production, got a lot of catch up on, so let's do it. Is it? It says they had a crocodile here. Here, let's go here. Over here? Yeah. Oh man. <laughs> what a treat. You know, in Iraq? Yeah, you know the Saddam Hussein stuff? Yeah, in Iraq. You were yeah, in Iraq? So, yeah, sis, man. It was with oh. Americans, man. Good. Let this sis, I'm there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. When you, when you are coming from America, then you are a very good friend of mine. Well, thank you. Well, I love Ugandans. I'm very happy to be here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so, yeah. Thank you. Know, you. We are friendly people, you know. Yeah. People are appreciating. How, how long were you in Iraq? Uh, one year. I loved working with Americans. They are very understanding okay. people. Very understanding. Well, good. That that makes me feel good that mm. Americans treat you mm. well and very well. Yeah, we are feeding well, dressing well, water free. Everything was almost free of charge. I, I learned a lot of things from them. Good. How to behave, how to handle some difficult situations. Well, one of my favorite things is hearing how people view Americans. Mm. You know, Ugandans, like, Kenyans. Like Americans. Yeah. They are my friends because I have worked with them. Uh -huh. I have a lot of experience with them. They treated us well. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That is a crocodile. Is he here for research? Or how come how come you have him? Yeah, this is the research institute. Those are big, big places. Yes, Monique. Yes. How are you? I'm fine. Yeah. I'm from America. Oh, yeah. 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 And I'm glad we talked to the boss, so things okay. are okay. All right. So the fisheries here, the fish that they have, it's for educational purposes. So they can raise them up, they can learn about the fish, because a lot of the animals, a lot of the species are unique to this area and this climate, so they have to take care of them. They have their own research institution, uh, they educate people, and they just make sure the environment is kicking along and the ecosystem is preserved. Is that, is that good? Do they need to add more? No, that's enough. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Cross so if you know, I'm called Dennis. Like yeah. when you are still on, you can be passing and you say yeah, yeah. hi. Yeah, yeah. say hi. And we'll keep the friendship. Man. Yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, man. All right. Okay. All right. Nice time. Yeah, good to see you. Okay. I'll see you around. All right. I me. always see you coming. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know me. Yeah, All right, yeah. Tony. Okay. Take it easy. Okay. It's feeling better so I can shake hands yeah. now. All right. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Oh, yeah. Mm. Good morning, Karis. Sorry, I delayed. The work we have going on basically falls into two categories. We've got the medium to long term, and then we got the short term. Long term is with the partnerships of the manufacturers in India. On the short term, though, we're trying to make product to sell in December when I get back in the States. For the Christmas season, holiday season, I've got a couple Christmas markets I'm selling product at. So with the bags Roy's bringing back, and then also what we're making here in the factory, that's for this December. We've been here for about a week. 
Kara's been crushing it, so I wanna show you what we've been working on. Because I feel confident in the long term and how we're gonna make great products that I really want, and I think what you really want, there are also opportunities and things that I think will sell in the short term that won't translate into the great business that I ultimately wanna make, but I think can definitely get a success in the short term and help us fund what's really gonna take us forward. Therefore, I'm open to things now that I wasn't previously, well, because my previous focus was all about the long term. Now that I think we have a good understanding of that, that is until it changes again, but I think we can do things in the short term that help us get to that long term objective. And for some of that, that's what we got right over here. Got about 10 of these bags that Kareth made in the last couple days. Now what I've been going for is a bare leather tote, no lining, just leather, that's it. We switched that up. Got some local fabric here known as Katenge. We use two different types of local fabric that we source to make the interior of that bag. The reason in doing that is that the markets I'm selling and the initial customers are gonna be people who especially care about Africa. Therefore, having products that represent this community makes sense. Sell these at a good price, generate cash, that helps us tremendously to really get the gears going. So we made those bags and then we also working with the drawstring bag because with the fabric, it makes it really nice on the top of the bag, still using cow leather for the bottom so it's nice and strong. Um, but since we don't have sheep and goat, we need something for the top. Therefore, we're using fabric. And it's coming up pretty good. All right, sir. The wall looks better every day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A Josh Pro music producer, music, we do music every time. Yo. Yo. Katimbu Zamu Nyo Nyo Gede. Nama Kuroni Namu Gaba. Mokuba Kauna. Most Ident Ami Vuma Chomba. Yo. Moananze Kankwera Vunkwa Ten and Kebete. Abaku Kwatako Baby and Kebete and Pepete. Jogezoru Dichalu Gafuronze Mekete. We wangu di de Denzini Musaja Mekete. Abali Bako Kwana Bonna. Wabagana. Abale Tama Motoka Bonna. Wabagana. Abale Tama Yumba Baby. Wabagana. Wabagana Baby Ngoringa Rade. Yo, serious. Yes, brother. We love you so much. And I'm James from California hanging with my boys from Jinja. We're hanging in the sun having some fun we're gonna gun, be gun. number one gun, gun, gun. <laughs> 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 <laughs>